Hey, nerdlings! Yo, nerdlings! Yo, changing Yo, it up for I sup. am! Yo, sup! Yo, sup! What up? <laughs> You're so street. I am. From the Midwest street. Wow. <laughs> the hard streets <laughs> I of am. Missouri. Woo! Yeah. Anyway, what we got today? <laughs> well, the question today is, do you nerd for limited run? We do! Alright, so, uh, of course, we love our limited run games because yes. we love what they're doing with the whole putting digital games onto a physical media. Mm -hmm. uh, because, you know, I mean, hey, with uh, like the Wii eShop closing oh, yeah. down, you know, it's like, that's it. No more games for the that's Wii. That's why you on the shouldn't digital... trust digital formats. <laughs> <laughs> but they did something really cool. Uh, we have a fun game. Get this out of the way. <gasps> How's this for a surprise? We got our ticket! No, not that. <laughs> Rob at Limited Run Games uh, was actually talking to us via Twitter and he honored his cookie pack. So we got Check cookies. it out. He sent us some cookies. So if you did not see the uh, Limited Run Saturday morning RPG video, I had given them a hard time on Twitter and I referenced it in that video that it had taken so long for them to get that collector's edition to us that. Uh, we would be willing to forgive them if they sent some cookies and they didn't send it with that and no. he actually apologized and he said that he is someone who follows up he honors his cookie pad and he did so some red velvet and, we got Oreos. That cookie. and not only did we get one bag of cookies or box bag i don't know what, what are these like <laughs> cartons <laughs> I, don't know what these are. I think they're bags. Trays. <laughs> Trays of cookies. But he got us some carrot cake Oreos. And, I've never uh, tried those before. I've know. had the red velvet before. And they're good. They are good. That is one of our favorite things to do. We always, whenever we go to the grocery store, we always go check out the Oreo aisle to see what new Oreo is out. We yeah, always have to try like them. Every time you go, there's yeah. a new one. And some of them aren't so good. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm very interested in the carrot cake ones because I do like carrot cake. It yeah. is pretty good. And we even have a note we that do. says, I took a risk on the carrot cake. Hope you like. Signed, Robert. So thank you very much. I am sure that we will yeah. like it just fine. And Let me have the you, other prize that's in there. Thank you again, by the way, for uh, honoring the cookie pack. I really appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, but better than cookies. Come on. Better than cookies. Look how nicely sealed That's what I want. Oh, they're really hard. Oh. There we go. There you go. Don't let Jalen down. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, those are hard. <laughs> All right. So, doesn't look like there are any more cookies, no cookies. in there. And we got a limited Ooh, a run sticker. sticker. Nice gold one, too. And then we got some cards. Holy cow. Wow. These are nice. Those they're, uh, are cool. They're very shimmery. They are. They're like almost like a foil wrap kind of on them. And it's um, the little uh, lizard, chameleon, and bat from Yuka and then Laylee. The bat's Laylee. And Yuka's the lizard. The first one is just, you know, them just posing for like a, like a picture. And then there's one of them where they're sitting on an island that looks like it's being held up by a Greek pillar. That's kind of interesting. And then one, they're uh, pretending to be um, Nightmare Before Christmas. <laughs> Very nice. <laughs> In the wintertime. All right. Well, as much as we love the cookies and the cards and the sticker are awesome, we did not order those things. What we ordered was ukulele for the Nintendo Switch. And we went for the uh, the special edition it one. It looks like a 64 box. Exactly! And... Oh, it's already in a protective case. How cool is that? And the case! Check it's it out! It's a limited, like a Switch special edition like one. So that's very cool. And look at how gorgeous Ooh. that box is. It's all fresh and clean. Crisp and clean and no caffeine. Nice. Where the 64 usually is, they just stuck limited run. Which is very cool. Uh -huh. 
the heck are those things? Now, by comparison, I actually have Banjo Kazooie right here. So, wow. you can see that the uh, yeah. size of the boxes match up very nicely. And check it out, they even did the blue border and the green border. Nice. But yeah, that check out, see, like I said, the little, the little 64 label. That's really cool. I like when they do stuff like that. These guys look adorable, though. <laughs> now, of course, I had to use the Banjo-Kazooie box to uh, compare the two because ukulele is very similar to Banjo-Kazooie. I have to say, ukulele is a lot cuter than Banjo-Kazooie. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, let's check out what's inside the box. Right, so open this up because games are not meant to be sealed. No, they're meant to be taken out and played with. And check it out! Oh, it's the ukulele cartridge! That's so cute! <laughs> that's now, adorable. Now this was actually just for fun. It is a non-functioning yeah, Nintendo 64 cartridge. But that is Awesome. Look at I high love treasures it. In here. Oh, there you go again with your treasures. I love the high treasures. It is kind of neat because I mean it looks exactly like a cart, but on the back it's all blank where <laughs> instead of having all that like warning labels and Nintendo and everything on there. But I mean they've even got the little cutouts and everything. And then they have cool. a soundtrack CD, which is always great. And the nice thing is looking at the back of this, the track list, it seems as if this is the full soundtrack. So nice. no sampler. Not like, hey, here's five songs. Enjoy. Didn't the 25th anniversary of Mario something do that? Don't even get me started. <laughs> Here you go. What's that? Ooh, it looks like a poster. It's a big one. Holy cow. Look at that cast. There's a <laughs> lot of people there. Holy moly. Is that like the moon from, from Legend of Zelda? <laughs> It looks like you have people from everything. You've got people that look like Toe Mater from Cars. You got some uh, weird fruit face people. Why is there a duck in a bubblegum <laughs> container? It's keeping them fresh. Is this a pack of cards that came to life over here? It, it kind of looks like it. It looks like everything you could think of has yeah, come to life. There's a slot machine that's come to life, a shopping cart that's come to life. There's a lot on here. There's an octopus with a Bowl, bowl of water on her head so she can breathe. Well, yeah. You gotta be able to breathe your water. Wow. There's a swamp. <laughs> all right. And to go along with all of this, of course, we have the game on the Nintendo Switch. Now, Ukulele did come out on a couple of other platforms before this. I know PS4 especially. I believe it was also on Steam. Um, but I was actually <clears throat> waiting for the Switch release for this. So have you ever played it? I have not. And that is why, because I wanted to wait for this to be on Nintendo, because I felt like that was the perfect place to yeah. play it, since it's kind of a, uh, a spiritual successor of sorts to Banjo-Kazooie. All right, so inside, you have the art on the back of the label, and Look what is above the cartridge. There's an instruction booklet. Oh, I love that uh, Limited Run always puts some manuals in their games. <laughs> That's how it should be, yes. by the way. And, of course, the little Switch cartridge itself. And that manual. Full color. Wow, that's impressive. Do you guys remember back in the day when we would get manuals? You know, and it's actually from the game, but they would be in black and white. Yeah. It's like, wow, way to not try. <laughs> it's expensive printing all that stuff out. All right, well, 
this. What do you think? What do you think of the, uh, the collector's edition for ukulele? I think it's really cute. I love this. I think this is great. You know, I'm not sure what we're going to do with it. Like, <laughs> people are going to pull it off the shelf and be like, I want... Oh, I can't play it. Yeah, they'll be trying to uh, plug it into the <laughs> like 64. It doesn't work. Like, you know, this game doesn't work, man. You need a new one. <laughs> Well, I, of course, always love to get the soundtracks to games because they are perfect for us on road trips. Mm -hmm. They are. They're really great on road trips. We like to always pop those in. And I love the attention to detail on the box. They mm -hmm. did a really great job, especially with, like, you pointed out, the limited run taking the place of the, place of the N64. Yeah. And I even love the uh, box protector with the Nintendo Switch theme going for it. I know. I, I think they should do that to all of them now. And, uh... I also like the cookies. I know. I want to try the carrot cake cookies. All right. Well, nerdlings, I would love to hear your comments about any of this here, whether it's the game, what you think of the game, what you think of the collector's edition that came out for the Switch, or what you guys think of the cookies. Did so, we just start something, though? Is everyone going to demand cookies now? Uh, this, is, this is probably a one-off, guys. Sorry. <laughs> but... Please leave a like to the video if you happen to like it, and consider subscribing if you have not already, because as you see, we are always having fun yeah, with the video games we are. and cookies and Limited Run, because they do a lot of awesome stuff. And hit that notification bell, because we're always putting out videos. And don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for those closer upper pictures, what we're doing out and about in the real world, and to let you know that YouTube has dropped a video, because sometimes they drop the ball and don't let you know that a video has dropped. Nice segue there. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> and don't forget, we have merchandise over on TeePublic, because we want to see people in our shirts, because our shirts are cool. <laughs> All right, nerdlings. Well... I think it's time for us to uh, see how this stacks up to Banjo-Kazooie. Well, it's stacking up real fine right here. And let's see how uh, these cookies stack up next to a glass of milk. Mm. Bye, Bye nerd ladies. Oh, man. That smells like... Oh, wow. That smells like carrot cake. Yeah, it does. Mm. Oh, mm. and that cream cheese smelling frosting. Oh, wow. That's mm. good. Oh, that is so good. It is. It says it's carrot cake flavored cookie with real cream cheese frosting. Robert, you did good. It you did good, real bro. good. Mmm. This one has real cream cheese frosting, too. Now, we've had the red velvet before, but we've never had them from Limited Run before. That difference, it's in the cream cheese. It is. Yeah, that's how you do it. That's good. Gotta say, I think the carrot cake's my favorite. I think so. Carrot cake's my favorite now. Um, 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 um. <laughs> it's like a little chameleon -y lizard on there with a bat on his head, which is um, ukulele. I forgot which one. Yuka is the lizard and Layla. Lay, no, Yuk. What's his name? Okay, stop. <laughs> what we ordered was. Cookies. <laughs> <laughs> what we ordered was. Don't, always. Don't forget to always. like. <laughs> Let me talk my turn. <laughs>